So if Linda knows that you are giving it your all and that you're doing everything that you can do and that you're, you are really focused on it, nobody really has your back, I think, like, like she does. Um, as a student, as a coworker, as a friend, I think when, when Linda is there for you, she is all in um, to help you in any way possible. The thing that kept me going is that I always did something different and new. And I always had principals who said, okay, uh, and didn't question me too much, but believed in me enough that I would get things done, that I would take care of the students that I taught and I would teach them a lot. Um, and so uh, I, I was really, you know, very grateful. I am very grateful for the principals that I had who questioned me, but never said no to me. So that was a really good thing the beginning of students having laptops. Um, there were curriculum, writing across the curriculum. There were big programmatic changes that she was started the wave of all of those pieces. So when you look at things that have happened in the county, um, I think she's part of a lot of those big initiatives. Uh, for me, the value of my career is all internal. I'm, I mean, I've loved it. I've loved everything I've done. Uh, I see myself still as a teacher. I'm always teaching somebody to do something. I think the people that she worked for and with, um, you, you learn, I learned over the years how to um, be a leader, how to work with people. Um, when I'm in situations still, I kind of think about what would, how would Linda Gillespie handle this situation? How would she move these people forward? I stay in touch with a lot of my former students and it's amazing to me what they have become. Uh, it's just, uh, it's, it's so much fun to do that, but it's also really uh, validation, if you will, of uh, work that I and other teachers have done with them to bring them where they need to be as adults.